Hello, sports fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. Today I'm here with the next game in the Arizona Wranglers uh, Sportsman Z Football League game season. And as you can see, we are playing, I believe it's Dallas, is it? No, Minnesota. We're playing Minnesota today. And Minnesota happens to be one of the teams, as you can see, that's tied for the division lead at one game better than us. So it's going to be a uh, it's going to be a slam bang scuffle. It's not going to be as easy as the Buffalo game. I did not even expect the Buffalo game to be easy, but it was. So, and I highly recommend you go back and check that out if you haven't. But we will start the uh, start the week. Get these games underway. You can see the uh, Jets are one and nine. Very, very bad one and nine, and Detroit is two and eight, not much better. So, we appear to be ready. And we will launch it. I guess they called it, and uh, we're home. So, we're kicking off. So we're going to get the ball to start out the second uh, half, which is good. And the kickoff is taken by Minnesota at around their four. And we stop them at their 16. Nice. So they got a first and 10 at their 16. Uh, Kirk Cousins is their quarterback. So this is the 2018 Minnesota Vikings. Um, I'm going to go... I think I'm going to go uh, balanced. Not sure exactly what they're going. Whoa, they're out there. Uh, uh, false start. So nice. They got a first and 15 now at the 11. And that makes it easier. I'm going to say pass. And that's incomplete. So they got a second and 10. Definitely going pass now. And that was uh, probably on us because they're letting the play go on. I would assume. Yes. So now they got a first and ten at the thirty-six of uh, of their of their own thirty-six. I'm going to put in the run. Uh, well, now they had a false start. All right. So now they got a first and fifteen at the thirty-one. I'm going to put in the pass again now. That's going to be an interception, baby. And I am going to try to gain some yards, too. And look at this. Whoa. Wait a minute. Come on. All right, I'm going to fall. I'm going to fall on the ball. Yeah. All right, so we did get the ball back after we fumbled after our interception. So we have the ball first and 10 at the Minnesota 24. I am going to go flat pass to the flanker. And that was caught. So, yeah, we got a nice six-yard gain on that. I'm going to go flat pass to the tight end. And that's going to be incomplete. So we've got a third and four. Well, he knows what we're going to do. Flat pass to the split end. And that's incomplete. All right. Um, I'm actually going to put in the pro set, and we're going to go for it on fourth and four. And I'm going to do a flat pass again to the tight end. And that is complete. Had to gamble there. I mean, I, we were too close. I'm not giving this up. So we're going to go off tackle run with the halfback. And they were going to be a false start. So we got a first and 15. At the Minnesota 16, I am still going to do that. I'm going to go off tackle halfback. And they, they track them down. So uh, we got no gain. We got a second and 15. Now I'm going to go short to the split end. 
And that's going to be caught. And he gets a first. No, he doesn't get a first down. So we've got a third and three. Huh. I'm going to go end run with a halfback. He'll never be looking for that. He should not be. And he gets stuffed. All right, fourth and three. I got a kick because we can make it from there. I mean, if you don't know, um, our kicker is Frank Corral, and he's a terrible kicker. He's a 50%. But from this close, he misses even from this close. I knew it. All right. Well, we're going to put in the run. Uh, we're looking for the run, and he gets mega yards. Nice. Uh, I'm going to go balanced. We stop him right there, but he catches it for a first down. I'm going to go run again. Now, this time he's passing. And he gets a first down. Now he's moving the ball on. It's like it's going out of style. All right, I'm going to put in the pass defense. And he, I guess he ran it, so they've got a second and five. I'm going to put in the run. And he passes it, and it's incomplete. So, uh, yeah, we're going to third and five. We're going to put in the pass defense. And I don't know what happened there. He got four yards, so they got a fourth and one, and they're going for it. I'm going to go, I'm going to look run. And he passes and makes it. All right. Uh, we're going to put in the pass defense. First and 10 for them at the 20. And they're probably, well, they're not going to score, but they're right there at the doorstep. I'm going to put in the run again. And that's incomplete. So they got a second and goal at our three. I'm going to put in the run again. And that's a touchdown, but was he? Yeah, I'm going to accept the penalty. Hell yeah. All right. So I'm going to put in, I'm going to put in the pass. No, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm going to put in the pass. Second and goal. And it's intercepted. Thank you. I got to try to run. I got to gain some yards because we're hemmed up. All right. So I'm going to go off tackle with the halfback. And we're going to be tracked down. That was a nice stop. I can't believe we stopped him. I'm going to go uh, look in pass to the flanker. And that's going to be offsides uh, on somebody. So I got a third and 19 at the Arizona 9. Huh. Well, you know what we're doing. You know what we're doing? We're going long. Going to be incomplete. But at least we have a chance to punt out of there. And we stopped him from scoring. So first and ten, they have, Minnesota has a first and ten at their own forty-two. I'm going to put in the run. Just got a feeling about this, and it's a bad feeling because it's not right. But he, uh, it was incomplete. Yeah, let's let's try run again. 
Oh, now he passed it. So he's got a third and two. I'm going to put in the pass. Now he runs it, of course. All right, I'm going to put in the pass. And we stop him, but, you know, we were looking for it and uh didn't work for us. So he has a first and 10 at our 31, and they're going to be false start. So they got a first and 15 at our 36. I'm going to go in with pass. And he does complete it. But now they got a second and nine. I'm going to put in the pass again. Maybe we can pick Cousins off again. I don't know. Hopefully. But that's incomplete. So he's got a third and nine at the 30. I'm going to put in the pass. And we don't stop him. He did pass the ball and we didn't stop him. So I'm going to put in the run on first down. And he, whatever that was, he got a first down from it. So I'm going to put in the pass. And he runs it, but we stop him. That was good. He's got a second and goal with four seconds left in the first quarter. Second and goal at the Arizona 10. I'm going to put in a pass. Yeah, this is a tough game. And we do stop him. So he got three yards there. He's got a third and goal at the seven. I'm going to definitely put in pass. He runs it. And we do stop him, and he should kick a field goal there. So, yeah. I'll put in the kick defense. And he does make it, though. So, Minnesota's ahead 3 nothing as it creeps into the second quarter. Our defense has been saving us, really saving our butts here. Um, I'm going to just take a touchback. Going to go flat pass to the halfback. Incomplete. I'm going to go end run with a halfback. And he gets some yards. So we got a third and six at the air at our own 29. I'm going to go flat pass to the tight end. And that's going to be good for a first down. Nice. We got a first and 10 at the Arizona 36. Going to go off tackle with the halfback. I am not going to give up on the run game. Although Minnesota is probably really good against the run. I didn't check that before the game. But I, as I would expect they are. I'm going to go short to the split end. On second and 10 from the 36. And he gets sacked. So now we've really got a third and 16. Got to go short to the flanker. And that's incomplete. So we got a punt. Yeah, Minnesota's uh, proving to be a very tough opponent. This is not at all an easy game. But we do down the ball at the 22, which is good. I'm going to put in balanced for the defense. And he passes it. I stop him right at the first down marker. He's got a first and 10 at his own 32. I'm going to put in the pass. That's incomplete. Um, second and 10 at the 32, I'm going to put in the pass at his own 32. And uh, we were looking for the pass, and apparently that didn't matter. 
So he's got a first and 10 at the Minnesota 48. I'm going to put in a run. And he does run, and I don't stop him, even though he did run the ball. I'm going to put in the run again. And he does run this time. We do get him in the backfield for a minus two yard loss. So he's got a third and five at the Arizona 47. I'm going to put in the pass. And he completes it. And I don't know why that guy broke off, but probably because he was supposed to get the gain he was supposed to get. All right, first and 10 at the, at the Arizona 17 for them. I'm going to put in the pass. Uh, second and five, I'm going to put in the pass again. If we lose this game, we'll be six and five, which is really not very good. Although the actual Wranglers were uh, 10 and eight. They had an 18-game schedule, and they were 10-8. and eight, So that would be par for the course. Um, this is a 16-game schedule like a regular football, uh, like a regular NFL football season. But, and there they go. They got a touchdown. So the Minnesota Vikings pull out to a 10-0 lead if they make this kick, which I'm sure they will. Well, they do, but let's see what the flag is. Yeah, I guess it was, I don't know. Going to take it for a touchback, obviously. I don't think we can run it back from out of our end zone, so. Uh, we got to get... You know, we got to get going here. I'm going to go long to the split and see if we can manage to do that. And it's incomplete. Let's see if we can get them again. I mean, they were kind of flat-footed there. I thought we had a chance, except they didn't complete the pass. And this time, no. All right, so we got a third and 10 at the 25. Now we got to make our, set our sights a little shorter with a short pass. And that's incomplete. We got a punt. Well, there is a flag. I don't know who it's on. We'll have to see. Hopefully it's on them because they're going to run it all the way back for a touchdown. So, or close. And it was on them, thankfully. So we've got a fourth and ten. We're going to punt again. Let's hope we don't allow a return like that. Although, I mean, I got to say, based on what I've seen, it looks pretty grim. We can't, you know, seem to stop them unless we intercept. And then he does the same thing. Except this time it will be a touchdown. So you have to think he rolled the two on his card for touchdown twice in a row all right we're gonna put in kick block yeah i don't i don't see us coming out of this one with a win i mean i really wish i could they're gonna kick off and i'm just gonna go ahead to the i'm gonna go ahead in the game to the second half after i take this for a touchback All right, so let's see. Game, um, autoplay until thirty minutes remains in the game. So it's seventeen nothing. No, it's 20 to 7. 20 to 7, and uh, we just started 
the second half. So um, I am going to put in a flat pass to the split end. So we're down by almost two touchdowns, not quite. Um, I'm going to put in the pro set again. Line buck with the full with the halfback. And he breaks it up the middle for some nice yards. So good. Got a little breathing room here. Now we're going to go off tackle with the halfback. He probably is going to look for the pass most, or the run. Ah, he should be looking for the run. That's true. Or no, he should be looking for the pass. So he'll probably be looking for the pass most of the time. We got a second and 12. I'm going to go end run with the halfback because he should be expecting us to pass. Well, that's going to be third and 12. We're going to go short to the split end. And that is caught for a first down. Good. I mean, if we can score right here, it's 20 to 14, then I'm not feeling so bad about the our chances, but we've got to, uh, but we got to play better. I mean, we've just got to all around play better. That's going to be complete, and he almost got the first down, but not quite. I'm going line buck with the fullback. And he'll get the first down and some more. Nice. Nice run there by the fullback. So we have a first and 10 at the Minnesota 38. Got to go flat to the tight end. And he does catch it. So now, yeah, this is good. We're moving the ball, second and four. Going to go end run with the halfback. Again, he just really probably has, he's probably good to excellent against the run. So um, third and four, I'm going to go flat to the tight end. And he catches it. Now we got a decision here, fourth and three. I'm going to go, I'm going to go out of the pro set. I'm going to go for it because we cannot not score here. I don't think. Flat pass to the split end. And he does make it, and he gets a lot of yards on it. Nice. So, uh, yeah, a little bit of a, I mean, I don't know if it was really a risky call. I think it was just a no-brainer. You're not going to. Ooh, that was a nice run by Spencer. You're not going to, you know, you're not going to score if you're on a drive and then you just decide to punt the ball. We're going to go look into the tight end. And that's incomplete. Third and six. I'm going to do another look in pass this time to the flanker. Now to the half. Let's go half back. Yeah. And he catches it for a touchdown. That's what we needed right there. Absolutely what we needed. Going to kick the extra point, and it is good. So there you go, twenty to fourteen. We're in the game. There's eight oh five left in the third quarter. So we haven't quite lost the game yet. Although these kick returns are killing us. All right, I'm going to do a linebacker blitz. See what that gets. Oh, we tracked him down. Nice. Uh, I'm going to do that again. All right, this time he's passing. And we did knock the ball away. So this time we're going to put in a pass defense. Let's hope he doesn't complete it. And he doesn't. It's not in, intercepted, but they're going to have to punt. So we'll we'll do a punt return.
Yeah, I got to run with the ball. We can't let it bounce. He only got two yards. So we have a first and 10 at the Arizona 22. Let's go short to the split end. Oh, he's going to be sacked. Unbelievable. 603 left in the third quarter. Well, now, I mean, now my, my game plan is taken out of my hands. I've got to go. I've got to pass. Not a lot I can do. And that's going to be incomplete. We're going to go. Uh, we're going to go long to the split end. And he'll be sacked again. Is that going to be two points? It is. So now it's 22-14. And we have to punt. They got a first and 10 at the 21. That's about the best news I've seen in a while, except for our touchdown. We do stop him, uh, but before the first down. He's got a second and five at his 26. There is a flag on the play though, and they're letting it go, so. Uh, he's got a first and 10 at the 48, Minnesota 48. So that was on us. Going to put in the pass defense. We do hem him up, though, even though he ran it. We're going to put in the pass again. So 22-14, now we have to go for a an uh, eight point touchdown if we get a touchdown. If we, assuming we stop them here, if we don't stop them here, then I'm moving ahead in the game because uh, it would not appear that we would win. And we stop him right at the first down marker. So he's got a first and 10. I'm going to put in balance. First and 10 at our 28. Minute 57 left in the third quarter. Uh, he's got a second and five at our 23. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put in the run because that it's really what he should be doing. No, he's going to pass. And he's going to get a good yardage on that. Now he's got a first and goal at the Arizona 10. And I'm going to put in the pass. And he makes a touchdown, so not good. Kick block. All right, he's kicking off to us. After the kickoff, I'm going to move ahead to about halfway through the fourth quarter. I mean, the last time I did that, we actually ended up probably playing better during the time that I was not controlling the team. So maybe we can try that again and maybe it can work for us again. Five seconds left in the third quarter. I am going to go um, auto play to eight minutes left in the game. And it's 29-14, it looks like. 29-14 with 7.55 left in the game. They've got a first and 10 at their 41. And we stop them before the first down. We're going to look rotten because that's pretty much what he should be doing anyway. Well, he doesn't get any... Yards after the catch on that pass, but he does have a first and 10 now at the Arizona 43 with 6.59 left. Going to put in the pass. And he gets a first down, even though we were looking for it. Going to put in the pass. But we can see why they were 7-3 and three coming into this game. 
Um, gonna put in the pass. So we're down by two touchdowns, and, and it's about to be three. Pass. And Kirk Cousins runs with it, doesn't get the first down. He's got a second and goal. I'm going to look for the run. And we do pick up on it, and we stop him. So he's got a third and goal from the three. I am going to look for the run again. I mean. And we do stop him because we were looking for it again. So now he'll kick the field goal. And he will make it. So he's ahead 32-14. We need three touchdowns um, to do anything. Um, so we really, are, we're, we're going long because there's like only 301 left anyway. That's what he should be looking for. It's incomplete. You know what? I'm not even going to do that. Let's go and run half back. Try to get some stats because he won't be looking for the run. Got a third and eight. I'm going to go end run with the half back. I mean, you know, and, and this is. Remember, this is not real football. In real football, maybe you have a, you really you don't even have a chance in real football at this point to come back from this deficit with this amount of time left. But, um, but your chances are a little better than if you uh, than if you're doing it in Stratomatic. In Stratomatic football, this format in this game, we don't have a chance. So a minute 52 left, I am going to put in the balanced. We do stop him. I'm going to put in the balanced again. And this time it's an incomplete pass. He's got a third and 11 from his own 29. I am going to put in the pass. And we sack him, but that's nice. Not going to help us, really. Going to put in the punt return. So, I mean, this game, it, it's really weird because, like, we when we played Buffalo, everything was easy. The game was just easy breezy. In this game, it's been an uphill battle the entire time. And as you can see, we're not going to win. So flat to the halfback. And that is going to be complete for some yards. I don't know why. Well, yeah, I know why I called timeout. There's only one second left. So we're going to go long to the flanker. Incomplete. Game over. 32-14. So let's see what that means for us in the standings, if you're hanging around still. Uh, the Cowboys and Vikings are both 8-3, and three, and we're 6-5 and five and tied with Houston with that mark. And... Uh, here are our final statistics. Well, these are our, our team statistics overall. Landry is 250 for 427 on the season, 15 touchdowns and 12 interceptions. Tim Spencer has 178 rushes with 700 for 745 yards and six touchdowns. Kevin Long has five touchdowns. And Mac Boatner has four touchdowns. So, um, so let's see. We have uh, next game is going to be Dallas. That's what I figured. And Dallas is probably going to be a very tough game to win. 
Uh, let's see. That's going to be uh, that's going to be the 2018 Dallas Cowboys. So I don't know. I mean, the real 2018 Dallas Cowboys were a Jekyll and Hyde team. So we'll see. Um, but that's it for me. Uh, you, you can see where we are. We've got another game next week against Dallas, and let's see if we can pull it out. But right now we're two games behind two teams, which doesn't bode well for us. That's it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.